Selena mm -hmm. Gomez, Kike? She what went happened? up to Taylor Swift to mm -hmm. gossip. Because apparently oh. that's all this little girl does is she gossips. She goes around telling secrets, Hollywood secrets, and telling everybody shit. Like, I saw this at a party and shit. I'm gonna tell you this, mama. Yeah, I'm yeah. gonna tell you what happened yeah. last and week. So she told something to Taylor, and uh, Taylor yeah. made the most shocking face. Like, holy shit, you saw somebody murder somebody? <laughs> well, luckily, there's lip readers out there. They're saying that Selena Gomez goes up to her and says, I asked to take a picture with him. And she's talking about Timothy Chow May, who mm. was there with Kylie Kylie Jenner, the baby Kardashian. Because he's, he's <laughs> fucking her. Because he's fucking her. <laughs> I'm glad that you're explaining all yeah, this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah. Selena supposedly goes up to, to Taylor and he goes, I asked to take a picture with him. And Kylie said, no. Oh, what a bitch. Yeah. Uh -huh. uh, this blew up all over the internet since the lip readers said that. Uh -huh. And everyone, including Entertainment News, came out and they said, at tea time, we would love to know if Selena Gomez was really gossiping about Kylie Jenner and Timothy Chow May at the Golden Globes. A source sets the record straight at the bio. And Selena Gomez, she replies to E! News and she says, No, I told Taylor about two of my friends that you don't know who hooked up. They were having sex. Not that that's any of your business. The dude's podcast, I took it upon me to comment. So this is what I replied. I don't like where this is going. Right. Yeah, I said, hey, mm -hmm. bitch, my friend Kike has a long dick. And he's white Mexican like you. Hit him up. His phone number is. And I put your phone number, Kike. And here's. I tell what the phone number is, you dumbass. Well, I, I fucking censored it because I'm not going to show it to everybody, but I put it for her so she knows it. Uh, and I said, and here's the address in case you want to show up and fuck him. And I put your address for her. Hey, Kike, imagine she shows up one of these days. That is not cool. You put my number and my fucking address. Bro. To her, he can't. To her. I just Everyone censored. Everyone can read this. No, I censored it for our channel, so these assholes don't you know. You squint a little and you can tell the fucking number, you No, dumbass. no, you can't. That could be a seven or a five. I'm not going to fucking say the number, but I, if you can squint a little bit. That could be a five. Everything. That could be a five, Kiki. Okay, whatever, bro. Well, anyways, I, uh, I waited to see if she was gonna reply, but instead she uh, posted she posted one of her fucking uh, stories, and she replied on her stories. Uh, <laughs> Check this out. She put, I don't know who this Kiki guy is. I'm taking a break and deleting my Instagram. I'm done. I do not support any of what's going on. <laughs> Kike. I don't need she, any of that. She deleted her account, Kike. Good. Oh my <laughs> god. That's the best that, that that's the best thing that could happen if that fucking uh fuck that bro. The fuck you, bro. <laughs> you, you made her delete her account, you troll. <laughs> Me? I didn't do anything. Focus. Hey, if you like this type of raunchy content, how about giving us a like and subscribing to our channel? And if you want to listen to more nonsense, click on the link to the right to listen to the full show. Cheers, dudes.